Tan Dolman had had a magazine out years beforehand as Dolman Grove and it was discussed with Talit Jameson and agreed that maybe I should pick it up and we should sort of reintroduce a new magazine, so we did. It was hoped, because many of the other organisations have magazines out, that we could come up with something that was different, current and relevant. And over the years it's gone from being written by only Clan Dolman members to having articles from other organisations, from authors, from people as far as the United States, and it's become a far, far more globally reaching magazine. We've looked at you know, out-of-body experiences in the early magazines, telepathy, and more recently we've looked at the connection between Luciferianism and Satanism in the pagan world. Um, we've looked at ritual cleansing, puppet magic, and a whole variety of different features. So in most issues, we try to include something that is a feature that includes several different parts. While being on Addison Clan Dolman is um, a large organisation, I am primarily a witch and I'm primarily a member of the community and the pagan community. And as such, I've been able to go into schools and talk about Wheel of the Year celebrations from a pagan perspective, I've been involved with the prison service as and when required, have gone and done celebrations, rituals, etc. Um, I've been involved in hand fastings, some within Clan Dolman, but many without. And one of the most important things that I feel I've been involved in, both for Clan Dolman and also beyond, is funeral services. And currently I'm on several of the books for going in and doing uh, pagan and humanitarian funerals when required.